Okay, so it seems like uh, the Javante Davis versus Mario Barrios pay-per-view had bombed at the box office. And I mean, it bombed real bad. Okay, it was just last night. And the night before, I noticed they were still selling the fight on pay-per-view. Even on Saturday, when they had the, you know, rebroadcast of the fight on the uh, Chris Colbert card, on Sunday, they were still selling the Javante Davis versus Mario Barrios uh, fight on pay-per-view. Like a week after the fight, they're still selling the fight. So that goes to show that fight had bombed. I mean, it was a good fight, but the pay-per-view sales had bombed. I mean, it is so low that no one is coming out with the numbers. Now, some say it was 70,000. Some say they heard it was less than 70,000. Some people heard it was 20,000. I'm like, damn. But from what I'm seeing on my uh, end, that they're still selling the fight on pay-per-view. It's a week old, all right? So it's time for, you know, these guys to stop telling the lies because, see, look, the reason why they lie by saying this guy's a star, that guy's a star, is because lies flies, okay? A, a lie will fly very high, all right? And people, you know, like we all do, we all believe everything we hear. I mean, hey, we taught in school, all right? When you're in school, you're teaching, you know, you're learning how to uh, understand things and believe things, okay? Like five plus five equals 10. That's true, you know, so on and so on, all right? That's why we believe, you know, all the uh, stuff that we hear. However, when it comes down to people telling these lies, this guy's a star, that guy's a star, you know, it's supposed to fly and people are supposed to believe it. But People are not believing that Tank Davis is a star, okay? In fact, I even hear some people talking about boycotting certain fights until we get what we want, what we see. But guess what? They are boycotting, okay? The boycott is real. Tank Davis, bomb. The Charlotte Brothers, bomb, okay? Now, when they say the truth may set you free, hey, they ain't lying. Because the truth has set the Charlo brothers free. Now, the fight before the last, their last fight, you know, Jamal Charlo, they were on pay-per-view. People were saying, oh, they did 780000 And then they dropped it to 270000 When it was all said and done, the truth came out. Bob Aram bombed them and said they only did 60000 Oh, I don't believe what Bob Aram say, this, that, and the third. However... The truth set the Charlos free. Their next fight was on free TV. It was on regular showtime. It wasn't pay-per-view. Why? Because they're not pay-per-view attractions. Okay? So that is the reason why, you know, they're, you know, they're, they're back on regular TV and not on pay-per-view. Okay? The truth set them free. You guys ain't stars. Okay? You're not. You're not pay-per-view material. And Tank... Davis, he's not pay-per-view material. You just can't throw him in the ring with anybody thinking it's going to sell. Hell, it didn't even do 100,000, 200,000 at that, okay? He's not there yet. He's not, the, he's not the star, okay? I mean, I would say throw him in there with their Teofimo Lopez, but hell, from what I'm hearing, Teofimo Lopez isn't all that legit either. He can't even sell a fight. And, and with this... You know, pay-per-view of his coming up. We're going to see how that's going to do. All right. I mean, will it sell? I pretty much doubt it. But if it do, hey, I applaud the man. You know, if it do, uh, you know, Earl Spence numbers, 270,000. Oh, he a star. 300,000 when he was lying. He a star. If it does 170,000, well, that's better than what Tank Davis did. And you know what? I believe they're still selling that Tank Davis fight is because Floyd Mayweather owes Tank money. He owes Mario Barrios money. Tank Davis was supposed to make a reporting, a reporting of $5 million off of this fight. A million dollars guaranteed and another like $4 million off the pay-per-view buys. But it, the pay-per-view didn't sell well. So they're still selling it now. I mean, I don't know. Maybe, you know, they 
stopped it today. Or matter of fact, last night, last time I checked, they were selling it again at 8, 8 a.m., okay? They, they, they were selling the fight again, okay, early this morning, all right? So they're doing it so they can pay Tank Davis his money. So Leonard Ellaby and Floyd Mayweather got stopped with the lies. Um, looks like Mayweather it may have to come out of pocket to pay Floyd Mayweather and, I mean, uh, Tank Davis and Mario Barrios, okay? Because they're guaranteed to make a certain type of money off of the pay-per-view. But it didn't do well. So it looks like Mayweather going to have to sell some of them chains, sell some of, him, some of those calls he got. And uh, give Mario Barrios and Tank Davis what they owe. And in his next fight, let the truth set the man free. He's not there yet. He's not a star. Put him back on free TV. Showtime, ESPN, whatever. Okay? He's not pay-per-view material. Floyd Mayweather, the promoter, is losing money. In fact, all these promoters is losing money. Okay? By doing this pay-per-view stuff. And they're not getting anything good in return. Now, with the Pacquiao fight, they may do just that. They, they may do good. They may try to rob Pacquiao in the fight because the numbers would be so good, all right? So, you know, it's a money grab, all right? So they may try to rob Pacquiao, maybe give him a draw when he really won. And, that, you know, that's if he does win, you know, if it does go his way, they may try to rob him. Why? So... They can get more money out of the fans and whatnot. You know, that'd be the most money PBC ever got out of a, a non Floyd Mayweather bout. OK. Yeah, the boycott is real. I mean, look, they can boycott all these other fights, including the uh, Canelo fights. I mean, because I, I don't even think Canelo is doing 600 and 700,000 pay-per-views. All right. However, you know, they can boycott these fights, but when guys like Mayweather gets up there and fight a regular old, some old uh, YouTuber, he could do a million or four million against uh, McGregor, Mike Tyson, Roy Jones, 1.5 million or 1.6 million. But these new heads, no, they're not there yet. OK, they got to start from the bottom, work their way up and, to, you know, earn pay-per-view stardom. OK, learn. They got to earn that star you just can't come out and lie say they're a star no they have to earn it so anyways that's my take on this javante davis pay-per-views bombed this is cmd boxing reports and i'll catch you guys on the next one